There are two aspects of, of, uh, of uh, this machine. It's very important for research and this is the major goal of the project. But the second thing is uh, uh, diagnostics. And uh, it's very important because we have deal uh, with uh, decision making based on the results of, uh, of study of some different type of cells uh, uh, which can be evaluated with this machine as well. And what is the most important, we know everything about, bio, about uh, um, pat uh, pathology, uh, uh, about uh, microscope, and in microscope we can see in the field, I know several fields, just hundreds maybe of cells and calculate if there are some uh, abnormal cells, sometimes it's difficult to see it with our eyes. And this machine can uh, count uh, in very short period of time uh, hundreds, thousands and millions of cells. So with this number of uh, events, we always can separate uh, uh, a small population of cells, which can be important for patient for uh, decision about his uh, or her therapy and finally about the life because if we have I don't know so-called minimal residual disease the rest after chemotherapy of very small population of uh, uh, malignant cells uh, depends on this which we make decision to go for more uh, extreme more severe uh, more uh, strong chemotherapy to go for bone marrow transplantation to uh, to make decision which is very important for each specific patient, not only to do some, I don't know, research or quantitation, etc. This is a, a very important, uh, maybe, addition from medical uh, uh, thing. How biology help us with this? Uh, and uh, another thing, I um, in this project, uh, as you know, uh, uh, as coordinator of this project, I. Uh, have a bifocal vision of this. So uh, we have medical side, we have scientific side, uh, which Manly explained very good because it took years to, to, to build this. And finally, I think that this is a, an important point, this equipment, not on, because of their specific function, but also as a building of new modern laboratory which can perform all basic methods in one place. And based on this, we will also discuss how to improve this. Based on this, this is the, the background for future maybe tens of years, dozens of, of years for development based on this. We can add here uh, additional stuff for cell culturing, which can improve our possibilities to do some experiments. Uh, maybe to add, I don't know, uh, say sorter, which is good addition to facts, to, to, to find this small population of cells, to select them like we do with stem cells, for example, and try to expand them, to, uh, to uh, bias them in different differentiation ways, etc. But in general, everything basically can be done, all modern methodology collected together. It took s several years, but it was uh, the goal which I s think very important for uh, university as a scientific unit for teaching a new generations. You see how many new students and people uh, uh, are here for teaching of PhD students, for involvement of uh, medical doctors who are interested in, in research and modern methods, etc. And this is bring more, uh, how to say, three-dimensional uh, uh, vision of clinical situation. It's not only stethoscope now or just number, result of this uh, zero, one percent of uh, blasts. What does it mean? Where are possible mistakes? Can we base on this our future decisions? So it's uh, uh, from bench to bench, uh, from from uh, 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 scientific modern scientific method goes immediately with shortcut with sh uh, uh, short bridging to uh, clinical decision and uh, clinic and. Uh, uh, 
uh, understanding, a new level of understanding of diseases, of approaches for treatment, risks, etc., etc., which are important for uh, every single patient. I think this is uh, very important for university and university hospital, which is uh, Sveta Marina.